Hi all folks, this is Max from uh, Epic4G Touch uh, Root.com. So um, I, v I was finally able to um, get an overclocked kernel working um, thanks to NeoVT on XDA.x360. Um, he had this kernel running on the original GS2 um, and I took s some of his files, uh, the over overclocking files, and simply loaded them on there. I um, mean, this is supposed. This isn't even my work, but um, this is. I just put it on my kernel. Uh, but this is supposed to give you a uh, 500 to 1.2 gigahertz uh, on demand default, and it should give you much better battery life than um, the rooted kernel I posted yesterday for rooting your phone. This one's also rooted, um, so you can use this instead of uh, the other one. And uh, basically, you can. Um, what is what is it? Uh, get set CPU app and then I've got it uh, pretty good at 1.504 I can go all the way to 1.6 but it's a little bit iffy and uh, it freezes on me but at 1.5 I'm getting like um, let me show you I've got 4,000 last time so it kind of brings up your phone makes it super fast um, it'll be working on more stuff but this is supposed to save your battery uh, I know a lot of you've been complaining that the uh, the other kernel was draining a lot of battery um, so try it out for those of you brave enough um, and let me know and I know some of you bricked your phone but uh, that happens if you if your Odin doesn't complete and you take the battery out that'll brick it um, that's what happened to me last time I think too so when you use Odin just make sure it's finished um, and use a faster computer that has a good, you know, so I got 39.27. Um, not too bad at 1.5. Uh, let's do Limpack. Run multi thread. Ah! Run multi thread. 81.56. Uh, 110. So it gets pretty good numbers. Um, try it out. I think this is the first overclock kernel for Epic 4G Touch. Um, Anyway, credits again to neovt.x360. Um, it's his work, not mine. I only put it on my kernel. But I'm still going to call this Zetomax Overclock Kernel. <laughs> uh, I'll improve it more. <laughs> or Zetomax Kernel. So, I'll see y'all later. Uh, thanks. Bye-bye. Oh yeah, to flash, just use Odin and flash the tar file. Um, just like uh, um, rooting. It's the same thing. It's also rooted. You can just flash this instead of the other file. So see you later.